so this is what I have here this is where I film I have a very small room we're still waiting on our house but I'll just get started of what I have how I have it organized at the moment I just have pictures up there um, <clears throat> here as you guys can tell I have these shelves or these little bins where, that I got at Target and Target I'll start off here here in the back I have my lipstick or my favorite lipstick brand all my Revlon ones Revlon and then back here I have Rimmel these are the Kate Moss collection but yeah I have them all there <clears throat> I have my color burst lip glosses and this little case or this little thingy here I got it from Ross it was like about four dollars so you could either get it at Ross and I've also seen them at TJ Maxx for like eight dollars which is more expensive but if you don't have a Ross near you or if you don't find it at Ross try TJ Maxx I'm pretty sure they have it so <clears throat> that's what it looks like I'm not gonna go over every single item just because it's gonna take forever but just very very briefly here it says a uh, Denver Colorado lipstick bar and I got this at a garage sale and I just loved it because uh, I thought it was perfect for my lipsticks now as you guys can tell I have my MAC lipsticks here <clears throat> these three are authentic our original ones these two over here are fake ones they were oh my bad this one is real let me see oh no this one's fake you can't even tell the fakeness unless you smell it so anyways this one's fake but the, the authentic ones that I do own is Viva Glam Nikki I have Pink no Novea and then I also have Viva Glam 2 the rest like I said they're fake but I still like to have them there so up here in the first little compartment I have some of my palettes eyeshadow palettes so I have this from Sony Kashuk it's the uh, prepping for the party lip and eye palette I have two of my comfort zones one broke so I got a, another one but yeah I have two of them actually I have all three comfort zones Move out of the way <clears throat> I have more here I have some NYX palettes went wild I have a Physicians Formula, Revlon, Revlon, and then I have some Victoria's Secret ones here, which these are amazing. I don't, I don't think they have this packaging anymore. This one's amazing. I just love it. This is in pink, and then I have also in a red one down here. So that's pretty much I have in here. My eyeshadow palettes. And the next one I have single eyeshadows and some quads back here. These are from Bisou Cosmetics. Let me just get closer. I have some Estee Lauder ones that I have back here. Some Revlon ones. Here I have two NYX ones. I have a Sephora one. I have uh, two NYX. And then I have two Nabi ones. A neutral Bisou quad. A Day to Night Elf. A black eyeshadow all my color hip duos from uh, L'Oreal <clears throat> I have my essence single eyeshadows one of my favorite ones is this one that's all like glittery and sparkly and then I have one Urban Decay single shadow and half baked my next one I have all my bare essentials or bare minerals I have a bunch of them. I'm not going to name them all, but these are all my Marabino Connection, and I absolutely love them. All here. <coughs> I have this Laura Mercier that was given to me when I bought something at Laura Mercier, that, um, the counter. I have some of my L'Oreal Infallible Eyeshadows, which I adore. So I have that there. I 
have all my Maybelline color tattoos here. Here too. I have two of my uh, Mac uh, Paint Pots. I have Bear Study and Painterly. I have a Jordana <clears throat> Eye Base Primer. A Bobbi Brown Long Wearing Cream Shadow. I have a NYX. I have a Mary Kay Cons uh, Primer. I have all my primer potions here. I have the original one, the Sin, the Eden, and I also have the, what is it, Grease or something like Greed? I also have the little mini one. And then I have a Cherry Moya, Essence, I have Too Faced, Lorac, Elf, mm. I have a Benefit State on Stray little one <clears throat> so yeah, these are all my cream shadows the bases the next one I have my gel liners I have black track two hip ones from L'Oreal three Maybelline I have two black ones one in brown my Urban Decay uh, what are these called jumbo pencils no glide on eyeshadow pencils I have some jumbo pencils here I have some eyeliners in the back liquid liners from Essence, L'Oreal, Maybelline. I have just a bunch and then I also have some Urban Decay ones and this Urban Decay eyeliner. The next one are all mascaras. Now I know mascaras you're supposed to like throw them out every six months but I don't do that. I try to save everything I have unless they're really bad. I'll just throw them away. But I have two of my eyeliners. I have an e.l.f. one and I, I mean, eyeliners. I have two of my mascara wands. It's, it's an e.l.f. and it's also a Gala one. I have this Fistus Inch formula that's good for like uh, brown eyes. L'Oreal Voluminous Black. Revlon Full Ready 3D. I have an Estee Lauder one. I don't know what it's called. It's called Sumptuous. I have the vibration one, the one that's pulse perfection from Maybelline. I have the primer from Cherry Moya. Which is this one. <clears throat> Benefits they're real. Benefits bad gallon brown. Uh Sephora one. Oh, this one's really nice. Sephora Outrageous Mascara. It's amazing. It's like $15 though. It's really nice. Urban Decay. This is a steel one. So I have those. And then up here. I have all my brushes and I have them in this little thing that I bought at Target on the kitchen section. It's just a, like a a spinning thingy. I don't even know what it's called. Um, and then I got these from the dollar section at Target. And I have my face brushes here real quick. Um, I have Real Techniques, Sonic Kashuk, Revlon. A random one. Real Techniques, Real Techniques. Uh... These are from Walmart. These are really nice too. These are the HD high definition something brushes from Walmart. <clears throat> Makeup Forever, Kabuki. I have all my Sig, well, my Sig Max ones in here. Flats up the angle one, round one. This is from Real Techniques. I really like those. I have a Posh Kabuki. I have more Real Techniques. Twenty Kashuk, Equals, Equal Tools, Elf, and all my eye brushes. I have them here. So anyways, I'll go to this one. <coughs> and I have all my eyebrow tools here, which this is just like a thing for like extensions. I just randomly put it there. I have a clear gel. I have a Milani Beauty Treats, a Bobbi Brown, some spoolies from Sony Fashion, this little thing that I got at the flea market, an e.l.f. one, uh, more spoolies, and... My, uh, my angle brush. This is from Rimmel. It's for my eyebrows. It's really good too. Some tweezers, some scissors, <clears throat> and a sharpener and a mini sharpener back here. So yeah. And here, it's gonna be a long video, guys. So bear with me. Elf High Definition. I have the rice powder paper, Mary Kay. Max Prep and Prime, Bare Minerals Foundation in Medium, I think. 
medium beige, which I only use like to when I use like a tinted moisturizer. Mineral Veil, uh, Laura Mercy, a little translucent powder, LA Colors, Makeup Forever translucent powder, and this is the Bare Minerals. It's been discontinued, but I still use it. It's for your, it's like a night treatment kind of thing. <clears throat> The, ne the next one is <coughs> all my highlighters. So here I have Revlon highlighter. I have a, this is actually like a dupe for the Too Faced one. It's a bronzer, but it does not come off like it for a bronzer. But it's from Rue 21. It was like $4.99. So Victoria's Secret Luminizer, the High Beam from Benefit. I have this Victoria's Secret highlighter, uh, Heart Candy Tiki. A brush from Laura Mercier fan brush this is a a radiance clear radiance from bare minerals I love bare minerals a Lumi this is a primer for your face but I find that it's, it works really great for a uh, highlighter for your cheekbones this is a, a little I depotted this one this was from Jafra I don't know where you can get that at but it was from Jafra and then I have this little sample from me girl meets pearl for highlighter, benefits, glide. No, gilded. <laughs> this is from Avon Ideal Shade. This is like to customize your shade. If, if it's too light, you if it's too dark, you put a little bit of this, and it makes it um, lighter. But it actually has like a sheen, so I decided to use it as a highlighter. I have a Sephora one. I have <clears throat> Elf, and then my Elf. A golden bronzer and this is my elf blush it's a blush but it, it's in got a glow but it works great as a highlighter so yeah that's all my highlighters right there and then here I have all my bronzers Victoria's Secret NYX matte bronzer cargo bronzer um, Revlon bronzers Milani bronzers I have two of them this is the Bare Minerals uh, the warmth, warmth, whatever. This is a <clears throat> Physicians Formula. I just love the packaging. I don't really use the, pa the product itself, but I love the packaging. It's really cute. Um, I have two of my powders that I use in my uh, for contour. This is a True Match. I love this one. It's my ultimate favorite one from Revlon Photo Ready. Contour. Bl contouring blush and bronzing Kula and then and like old school L'Oreal one right here and I feel my voice is going away okay this one is all my blushes so I do have like a big blush thing but oh well these are all my elf Clinique NYX cream blushes from Revlon Photo Ready these are all my Nobby ones and I've already made a haul on them and I already on my October, no, September haul, I have a link to where you can find it on, the, on their website. But yeah, I just love these blushes. They're amazing. I have my Wet n Wild back here, and then I have my Milani ones, which I really adore as well. Down here, I have more blushes. Actually, this is from Victoria's Secret. It's just like an all-over uh, body powder, but I just put it in here. Georgia something from benefit that came with this last year on black friday at ulta i got it for 19 dollars both of them so it's throb i have fox in a box hard, hard candy in i don't even know the color but skinny dipping i don't even know that was the color or the name that's a funny name but i just like it because it has like a bronzer and it has orange so yeah uh cozy tint Three of my Bare Minerals blushes. These blushes are amazing. I love them. They have really good pigmentation. <clears throat> a Heart Candy Milani. This is from Misty Lottery. They gave it to me when I bought something there. This is from Bare. No, what is it? Beauty Treats. And it's really cute. I also mentioned it on my past haul, which is September haul. I'll put the link down below that so you guys can see it, but it's amazing. I can't open it with one hand. Oh well. And then I have all, all my other Bare Mineral brush, blushes back here. So that's all my blushes. And then up here I have all my palettes. Let me 
here I have all my palettes back here I have my book of shadows for my nude on nude my from NYX my smoked palette here I have my coastal sense original palette my co uh, this is not coastal sense but I bought it from this lady and it looks like this and then I depotted some of my other blushes and put them in here with glue this was like three two years ago that I did this I know it was crazy, um, but I have them there and I still use them. I have my Victoria's Secret, the Naked palette, and then that other one that came like out last year. I have my Vice palette, my two Naked palettes, my Butt Naked from NYX that I can't get out. Oh, there it is. Butt Naked and then the very front, my Lorac Pro. Here I have like pretty much some of the essentials that I use like almost every day. My all nighter, MAC uh, spray, e.l.f. This is the D slick which I just but I really like it over the all nighter. So yeah. Here I have some samples that I'm actually trying out from Leo Welly, uh just the creams and stuff, you know, Clinique. Things like that. I have Buxom thingy here. And then in here I have all my bobby pins. I just have them in that thing. Here, this is something that I just got from Laura Geller. It's just 20 bucks, guys. And it was a retail it retailed for 62.50. So yeah. I have it there. This is for my iPod or my iPhone. I put it there. This is just a card that I got from New Willy, Texas when I ordered something online. I received this and I just have it there. Clinique, uh, different, dramatically, what is it? Dramatically different moisturizing gel. I have my sanitizer, my Estee Lauder for my face, for my eyes. I really like this. It's really, really ridiculously expensive. But I've had it for about two months already and I, I'm still like up here. You only need the tiniest bit of it. I have this little generous cream that they gave me also when I made that purchase so at least I got something like bigger size it's a moisturizer so I have my Sony Kashuk matte palette on oh, my Revlon just kit which is what is it just bit Kissables Revlon color burst Clinique moisturizers these are just some moisturizers that I can't I don't know where to put just because my section is so small, as you guys can see. And I have more creams, and then I just bought this eyeshadow that I really like. NYX Dance the t Dance the Tights. Sony Kashuk, Mali, and Estee Lauder. And here's my computer. Almost done. Over here, I have some stuff, and these are just like skin scare stuff. CeraVe creams, AM, PM makeup remover my toner and just some creams you know there I have my Evian spray this other spray that's from beauty control which I use which I use usually like when I get out of the shower and what or when I want to refresh my face it's pretty much the same thing as the Evian spray my makeup remover wipes which is the color ones and I always put them down that way all the moisture goes when I take them out I get all the ones that are moistened back here what is this oh this is from avon this is uh hair removal this is actually alcohol that i do when i want to clean my brushes or when i want to like sanitize something i have like a tape back there this is from neutrogena which i think it's been discontinued but you just like put like a little spongy here you turn it on and you pretty much micro it's a microderm something like that for your face and then some random stuff that I really don't reach out for more, except this one, which is to clean my brushes. I really like this one. So an Akashic brush cleanser. And that's pretty much it. And then down here I have all of this. So I'll go really, really fast. Here I have all my foundations, which I know it's a lot. But 
I love foundations and I've been collecting them for a while now and I do use every single thing you see in here. Everything you see in here, I use everything. Not at the same time, obviously, but I do use every single item. Everything I don't use, I put it on the side on a bag, which I usually have back there or down here, but I recently just gave some away. I either give it to my aunt or I give it to my cousins or I just give it away. I don't need it. I don't want it with me. I just rather give it to somebody that will have some use for it. So here in the back, I have some of the Red One Color Stay, Maybelline, uh, L'Oreal, Sony Kashuk. This is from Origins, New Balance, or Stay, no, Stay Tuned. I have my Naked one, Elf, Avon, Neutrogena, True Match, L'Oreal, Leo Ali, Triple Solution, Leo Ali Beyond the Solution. Revlon Color Stay, I love Revlon Color Stay. I love Revlon Color Stay a lot. I have two of them here just because one of them was too dark for me. But I have two of them here. Uh, true, what is it? Cargo. The oh, old. This one's really nice. Beautiful. It has really amazing coverage. And it does not feel cakey whatsoever. And then I have here Mary Kay. Makeup Forever, MAC Pro Longwear, MAC, um, MAC Studio Fix, MAC Pro Longwear, MAC Match Master, Estee Lauder, no, Makeup Forever, um, oh, here's my Estee Lauder, I was like, where is it? I really like this one, this one's really good, really, really good. Laura Mercier and my Matte Lumiere, or Lumiere Chanel which was horribly expensive, but it's really, really nice. The next one I have all my lipsticks. And I'm not going to go over a lot of them, but it's just pretty much L'Oreal, Maybelline. You know, pretty much drugstore. Drugstore, well, this one's Laura Geller. This one's not drugstore, but this one's... I have Bare Minerals. I have a NARS. I have... Just random ones down here. I have Stila. Yeah. These are all my other palettes, and I actually custom made this one. It's kind of like my Cheap Z palette, which I also I actually got the idea from this lady on YouTube like a year or I don't even know how long ago, but I'll put her link down below. That way, you guys can check it out how to do it, but that's what I have there. I have my smoked palette uh, pamphlet here, and I have some neutral. This is like these are the two dupes for the Too Faced Natural and Smoky palettes that I got from Rue 21. They're really nice. You guys can see really quick. It's really good too. Too a dupe. I have Stila, I have a uh, Elf, the Clutch one. This is another palette that I custom made. This one's a little bit more chibi, but that's what it looks like. And I have some Mary Kay palettes, some Elf, and the big Elf one in the bottom. These are my Too Faced. I have the Summer Eye, and I have my Romantic Eye. And these are just some e.l.f. ones that I pressed some pigments in here. What can I open it? There we go. I pressed some pigments in here. That way I can just keep them in here. These little quads are a dollar from Target. So if you guys are interested, you guys should check them out. Let me just put everything. Next one, it's all my eyelashes from like eBay. What is this? Stardale Lash. Um, some empty Mary Kay palettes. This is from prettyandcute.com that I got sent when I ordered one of my Leo Willy BB creams. They're sort of just like, like cotton pads or cotton for like makeup removing or whatever. I have two foundations that did not work for me, but I'm trying to still see what I can do with them because they were really expensive. During summer, a BB cream that is from Beauty Treats, which I have two of my BB creams that are from L'Oreal. And my Garnier, I just kept it because it was expensive too. And then here are just my backups of everything. So you guys can tell, just backups. The last one is for my... 
makeup removing wipes and that's it guys so that was all my collection sorry if i went fast but it was just because i don't want it to be a very long video